Good morning, everyone. Welcome to the Little Red Schoolhouse Annual Spelling Bee. Uh, this has been a tradition for many, many years. The building that you're sitting in right now was originally constructed in 1876. It serves also as a museum. You'll see different cabinets with memorabilia from the years. We're so pleased to have your children here to carry on this wonderful tradition. They're going to walk in, uh, sit in front of you, and our moderator is um, Ms. Michelle Connor. She'll introduce them to you. I'd like to introduce you to our judges. We have Ward 5 Counselor Ann Beauregard. moment of this and we're so proud of your children being here to make history in Brockton. I'm going to sit right here if we can see if it's comfortable for you. Congratulations. You have wonderful children that you've blessed us with today. Um, as uh, you were told, I'm Ms. Connors. I'm the Associate Principal for Curriculum and Instruction at East Middle School. Um, but I'm here today representing all middle schools. But go East. I'm just kidding. Uh, <laughs> your children are already winners. They are representing their schools today, and we're very happy and very honored to be here with them. So just to quickly go over the rules with you, I say the word. The student says the word spells the word, then says the word again. Before they say the word that second time, they can start over if they feel like they've messed up. They can ask for us to use it in a sentence, or they can ask us to define it, any question they want. Once they say the word that second time, that's like submitting their final answer, and they can't go back and erase after that. Do you all have any questions? Are you ready? You're not nervous, right? There's just a camera right here. I don't want you to be nervous. <laughs> it's not on me, <laughs> which is fantastic. Okay, all right. You shouldn't be. You should not be nervous at all. And if I'm shaking, don't worry. I'm just kidding. All right. Our first word of the day to Christian. So stand up, you. Oh yes, I'm sorry. Stand. I missed that part. And just speak nice and loudly because I'm old. Okay. Uh, all right. Budget. Budget, B-U-D-G-E-T, budget. That is correct. Michaela, your word is nylon. Nylon, N-Y-L-O-N, -O nylon. Correct. All right, Sasha, your word is library. Library, L-I-B-R-A-R-Y, library. That is correct. Jayla, your word is cinnamon. Cinnamon, C-I-N-N-A-M-O-N, -N -N, cinnamon. Correct. Christian, your word is divine. Divine, D I. V-I-N-E, divine. Correct. Renee, your word is domestic. Domestic. D-O-M-E-S-T-I-C, domestic. Correct. Emily, your word is personality. Personality. P-E-R-S-O-N-A-L. I-T-Y, personality. That is correct. Natalie, your word is tragedy. Tragedy, T-R-A, 
G E D Y tragedy. That is correct. Elias, your word is voucher. Voucher. V O U. T U R U voucher. I'm sorry, could you repeat that? T V O U. I'm sorry, that is incorrect. Priscilla, your word is voucher. Voucher, V O U C H E R, voucher. That is correct. Olivia, your word is haphazard. Haphazard, H A P H A Z A R D, haphazard. That is correct. Annika, your word is canvas. Canvas, C-A-N-V-A-S, canvas. That is correct. Jamari, your word is insistent. Insistent, I-N-S-I-S-T-E-N-T, -S -S insistent. Correct. Okay, Christian, your word is mystery. Mystery. M Y S T E R Y, mystery. That is correct. Michaela, your word is genuine. Genuine. G E N U I N E, genuine. That is correct. Sasha, your word is rhyme. Rhyme. R H Y M E, rhyme. That is correct. <clears throat> Jayla. Your word is radioactive. Radioactive, R-A-D-I-O-A-C-T-I-V-E, radioactive. That is correct. Christian, your word is gymnasium. Gymnasium, G-Y-M-N-A-S-I-U-M, gymnasium. Correct. Renee, your word is diminish. Diminish, D I M. I-N-I-S-H, diminish. Correct. Emily, your word is abbreviate. Abbreviate. A-B-B-R-E-V-I-A-T-E, -E, abbreviate. That is correct. Natalie, your word is communicate. Communicate. C O M M. Yes. C O M M U N I C A T E. Communicate. That is correct. Priscilla, your word is potential. Potential. P O T E N T I A L. Potential. Correct. Olivia, your word is altercation. Altercation. A L T E R. C A T I O N, altercation. Correct. Annika, your word is diagnosis. Diagnosis, D I A G N O S I S, diagnosis. Correct. Chamari, your word is prospectus. Prospectus, P E R S P E C E T I S T, prospectus. I'm sorry, that is incorrect. <coughs> Christian, your word is prospectus. Prospectus, P-E-R-S, P-E-C-T, U-S, prospectus. Sorry, that is incorrect. Michaela, your word is prospectus. Prospectus, P-E-R-S-P-E-C-T, I S prospectus. Sorry, that is incorrect. Sasha, your word is prospectus. Can you use it in a sentence, please? Do you have sentences over there? Well, I used to be in the world of finance, a prospectus, 
is a document that basically explains how you're going to interpret an investment and your expectations, rules, regulations, and policies. Pretty intense stuff for you guys. So, I found a sentence. <laughs> also, that was an excellent definition, thank you. All of the potential investors were sent a copy of the prospectus two weeks before the board meeting. Okay, prospectus. P E R. S P E C. T I O U S perspectives. I'm sorry, that is incorrect. Jayla, prospectus. Prospectus. P E R. S P. E C T E S Perspectus. Sorry, that is incorrect. Christian <coughs> Prospectus. Prospectus. P E R S P E C T A S Perspectus. Sorry, that is incorrect. Renee Prospectus. Prospectus. P R O S P E C T I S Prospectus. Sorry, that is incorrect. Emily Prospectus. Prospectus. P E R S P E C T I-S-E, Prospectus. Sorry, that is incorrect. Natalie, Prospectus. Prospectus, P-E-R-S-P-E-C-T-O-U-S, -E -E Prospectus. I'm sorry, that is incorrect. Priscilla, Prospectus. Prospectus, P-E-R-S-P-E-C-T-I-C-E, -E, Prospectus. Sorry, that is incorrect. Annika, prospectus. Oh, sorry, Olivia. My fault. Sorry, Olivia, prospectus. Prospectus. P E R S P E C T I S C E, prospectus. Sorry, that is incorrect. Annika, prospectus. Prospectus. P E R S P E C T I. Perspectives. I'm sorry, that is incorrect. Jamari, that was your word originally, correct? Okay. So now we give a new word. Yes. I, I just want to spell it for you all, okay? Um, Emily, you were the closest. I thought you were going to nail it on the head. I mean, Renee, sorry. Um, P R O S P E C T U S. All right. That's a tough one because I, I can't say prospectus. Um, all right. So let, give me just a minute and let me. Um, so we're back to um, the first person who got it, which is Jamari. Yep. And then um, Christian Nicholas is still in. Okay. As is Michaela. Okay. As is Sasha. Yep. Okay. As is Jayla. Yep. As is. Everyone else after. Christian. Okay. Okay, just wanted to make sure that's what I have to. Thank you. All right. Here we go, Jamari. Scarcely. Scarcely. S C A R C E L Y scarcely. That is correct. Christian. Colleague. Colleague. C O L O. E A. G U E colleague. That is correct. Michaela. Asterisk. Can you repeat that? Asterisk. Asterisk. A S T E R I S Q U E asterisk. I'm sorry, that is incorrect. Sasha, asterisk. 
Asterisk. A S T E R. Can you say the word again, please? Yes. Asterisk. Okay. Asterisk. A S T E R. E S. Guys, are over. Yes. Asterisk. A S. T E R I S K S answers? That is correct. Jayla. <clears throat> Catastrophe. Catastrophe. C A T A S T R O P H E. Catastrophe. That is correct. Christian. Homogenize. Can I have that in a sentence, please? Yes. Let me find where we are. I don't have that one. Let me think. Let me get my brain working. Double check. Could you provide a definition while I? Yes. Uh, homogenize to make homogeneous to reduce the particles oh boy, of two or more insoluble substances as of the fat in milk to such a small size that they will form a stable emulsion with another. Yes, please. <laughs> uh, for many years, dairy farmers have, have uh, no, no, I'm not going to say, dairy farmers today homogenize their milk. Thank you. Homogenize? H O M O G. E N I Z E homogenize. That is correct. <clears throat> Renee, integrity. Integrity. I N T E G R I T Y. Integrity. That is correct. Emily, optimism. Optimism. O P T. That is correct. Natalie, oregano. Oregano. O R. Oh wait, that's the one. Yes. A R. E G. E N O. Oregano. Sorry, that is incorrect. Priscilla, oregano. A definition? Oregano is a spice. Oh, I was going to use it in a sentence. Sorry. I can do that. Thank you. Can you please hand me the oregano for pasta sauce? Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Thank you.
EU oregano? I'm sorry, that is incorrect. Olivia, oregano. Oregano. O R E G A N O, oregano. That is correct. Olivia. Annika. 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 Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Indelible. Indelible. I N D E L I V A L E. Indelible. I'm sorry, that is incorrect. Jamari. Indelible. Indelible. E N D E L A B O E. Indelible. I'm sorry, that is incorrect. Christian. Indelible. Can you say it in a sentence, please? Yes. The black ink pen made an indelible mark on the girl's dress. Can I have a definition? Yes. Physically impossible to rub out, wash out, or alter. Okay. Indelible. I N D E L L A B L E. Indelible. I'm sorry, that is incorrect. Sasha. Indelible. Indelible. I N D E L I B L E. Indelible. That is correct. Jayla. Disbursement. Disbursement. D E S. Can I start over? Mm -hmm. Disbursement. D I S P U R S E M E N T. Disbursement. I'm sorry, that is incorrect. Christian. Disbursement. Can I have it in a sentence, please? Yes. The hedge fund was one that paid a cash disbursement to the investors monthly. Disbursement. D I S P U R. S E M E N T disbursement. I'm sorry, that is incorrect. Renee. Disbursement. May I have a definition, please? Yes. To pay out money, especially from a fund. Disbursement. D I S P E R S E. M E N T disbursement. Sorry, that is incorrect. Emily. Disbursement. Disbursement. D I S E. I'm sorry, that is incorrect. Olivia. Disbursement. Disbursement. D I S P E R S E M E N T. Disbursement. Sorry, that is incorrect. Sasha. Disbursement. Can you say it again, please? Disbursement. Disbursement. D I S P I R 
class E. Sorry, class over. Mm -hmm. Disbursement. D I S P I R S M E N T. Disbursement. Sorry, that is incorrect. Jayla, that was your word originally? I think the it tying was. into money was. was the tough part. It's D I S B. U R S E M E N T. A lot of you put the P in there because I think purse, money. Um, all right, so we're, everybody's, you guys back in. Uh, Jayla, your word. <clears throat> Carburetor. Carburetor. Can you please use it in I knew you were going to ask me that. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I can. <laughs> the mechanic had to replace the old carburetor in order to make the car run again. Carburetor. C-A-R-B-O-R. R-A-T-O-R. Carburetor. Sorry, that is incorrect. Christian. Carburetor. Carburetor. C A R B E R R A T O R carburetor. I'm sorry, that is incorrect. Renee. Carburetor. Carburetor. C A R B O R A T O R carburetor. Sorry, that is incorrect. Emily. Carburetor. Carburetor. C A R B O R R A T O R carburetor. Sorry, that is incorrect. Olivia. <clears throat> Carburetor. Carburetor. C A R B O R A T O R. Carburetor. Sorry, that is incorrect. Sasha. Carburetor. Carburetor. C A R B A R A T O R. Carburetor. Sorry, that is incorrect. Back to, back to Jayla. <laughs> All right, so carburetor is a tough one. C A R B U R E T O R. It's a toughie. You got all, almost all your vowels in that one. Okay. <clears throat> Jayla. Nuisance. Nuisance. N U I S S A N S. No. Can I start over? Yes. N U I, but nuisance, N U I S S A N. Nuisance. I'm sorry, that is incorrect. Christian. Nuisance. Can I have a sentence, please? Yes. <laughs> Having a new little brother was nothing but a nuisance for Paul. Nuisance. N U I S Can I start over? Of course. Nuisance, N U I S S
E N C E nuisance? Sorry, that is incorrect. Renee, nuisance. Nuisance. N U I S A N C E, nuisance. That is correct. Emily, exceptional. Exceptional. E X C E P T I O N A L, exceptional. That is correct. Olivia, malicious. Malicious. M A L. I-C-I-O-U-S, malicious. That is correct. Sasha, mesmerize. Mesmerize. Can you say it in a sentence, please? Yes. The reader was able to mesmerize the kids with his stories of knights and dragons. Mesmerize, M-E-S, M-E-R-I-Z-E, -E, mesmerize? That is correct. Renee, <clears throat> questionnaire. Questionnaire, Q-U-E-S. T-I-O-N-N-A-I-R-E, questionnaire. That is correct. Emily, relevant. Relevant, R-E-L-E-V. A-N-T, relevant. That is correct. Olivia. Excessive. Excessive. E X C E S S I V E. Excessive. That is correct. Sasha. Gnawing. 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 K N A W I N G. Gnawing. Sorry, that is incorrect. Renee. Gnawing. Gnawing. G N A W. I-N-G-9. That is correct. Emily. Legitimate. Legitimate. L. E. G. I. T. I. M. May I please start over? Yes. Could you please repeat the word? Of course. Legitimate. Legitimate. L-E-G-I-T-I-M-A-T-E. -E. Legitimate. That is correct. Olivia. Sanctuary. Sanctuary. S-A-N-C-T-U. A R Y sanctuary. That is correct. Renee. Discrepancy. Discrepancy. D I S C R E P A N C Y. Discrepancy. That is correct. Emily. Dominance. Dominance. D O M I N A N C E dominance. That is correct. Olivia. Ecstasy. Ecstasy. E X T I S C Y ecstasy. Sorry, that is incorrect. 
Renee. Ecstasy. Ecstasy. E C T. Can I respell please? Yes. Ecstasy. E C S T A S Y. Ecstasy. That is correct. Emily. Humidor. May I please have a definition? Yes. My father kept his best, oh, you would like a definition, I'm sorry. A container in which tobacco products are stored to prevent them from drying out. <coughs> yes. My father kept his best cigars in a glass humidor on the table in his den. Humidor, H. Sorry, that is incorrect. Renee, humidor. Humidor. H U M I D O R. Humidor. That is correct. Don't sit down. <laughs> One more. One more. Your word, Emma, uh, Renee, your word is impatience. Impatience. I am. P A T I E N C E impatience. We have a winner. Congratulations. All right. You all are amazing. Okay. These some of these words I was like I'd have to rely on spell check. Um, and I was getting very nervous because we were very close to the end of the list. And I'm sure our facilitators and judges have that special backup list. But I'm like, these kids are too good. <laughs> we're going to go through the whole list. All of you did such an amazing job. Those are difficult words. I think rhyme would have been the end of me. And that was very early on. <laughs> I always have trouble with that one. Uh, so. Ab absolutely amazing job. You represented your school so well. I'm so proud to be part of the middle schools in Brockton um, and so proud of all of you. Great job. You should be very proud of yourself. I was very ready to take out a grade 9 through 12. That's why I pulled my folder. That was awesome. That was really wonderful. Um, we have some small prizes for uh, for our second and third winners. And for all participants, all winners who came here to represent your school, you'll have a special certificate um, issued by the Little Red Schoolhouse um, for your walls. And um, we thank you all for being here. What a wonderful job you did. Yes, thank you. Um, the top three finishers to have a gift certificate to Paperback Junction, uh, which is a bookstore over in Northeastern. So I hope that you will um, be able to get over there and pick out something that you might like very much. And they have everything, and if they don't have it, they'll order it for oh, you. Oh, they do. They're very good. They do. Yes, right, exactly. They're very good. Yes. It's nice. They've been very good. Our second place winner is Emily Ta. And our first place winner, Renee Long.
And thank you so much, everyone, for coming.